What's going on guys, my name's Justin and welcome to my gear corner. On today's episode, we're gonna be talking about some leaks and some upcoming content based around John Mayer's upcoming album for 2021, hopefully coming out sometime soon. So spoiler alert, if you've been staying away from the leaks and anything that's been teased, don't watch this video until the album comes out. But if you wanna learn more and discuss, stay tuned and let's get right into it. When you talk about must-have effects pedals for John Mayer's tone, there are a few that are generally accepted as being within that category. You have a clean boost, your overdrive for light sounds, a tube screamer style overdrive, you have a slapback delay, and a longer delay. Now, pretty much since the days of the John Mayer trio, this has been the status quo for a John Mayer style pedal board. If you have those, anything else is just extra at that point. Now, if you've listened to the leak of Last Train Home, what we believe to be the main single for John's upcoming album, his tone is a lot different. It's thick, luscious, and full of modulation. And I do believe that chorus is gonna be this effect that's gonna be the next must have, especially for this upcoming album and the upcoming tour. Now, chorus is an effect that's not really been associated with John Mayer's tone. I mean, really the only time we've ever gotten chorus on an album has been during the Helpless solo, and that's it, that's one time. John didn't really use it that much for the search for everything, but in 2019 on that tour, he did start to experiment with using chorus in more of a lead tone thickening way, which a lot of people do use chorus for. John used a Boss CE2, he used a New Neighbor Inspire, he used a Free the Tone Try Avatar chorus as well during the tour, and he experimented with adding chorus to songs that you would never think would have chorus on them, like the outro solo for I Don't Trust Myself with Loving You. Looking back on the 2019 tour, it's clear that John was experimenting with this new effect that he'd fallen in love with, and he's probably wanting to make sure that in a live context and just overall for his enjoyment of tone, that chorus was gonna be something that would work for him with this new album that he was writing and working on. Now we also know from a teaser from behind the scenes during Last Train Home's music video recording, I say Last Train Home like we know that that's for sure the title, but most likely the prediction is what it's gonna be. John was actually using a Roland Jazz Chorus 120. Now this app, if you don't know, was kind of like the father of the chorus sound, and the Boss CE1 was actually based on the chorus unit from this amplifier. So John's clearly been messing around with this app in the studio as well. If it's in the music video, I'm betting that that's what he was using or experimenting with for that song. Because John, as we know, likes to use what gear he used when he writes things live, or especially in like a music video or something. So that Roland Jazz Chorus unit is gonna be something really interesting to watch and see what happens. Maybe he might bring it out on tour, maybe he won't, who knows. So this video is all about predicting the future. And as I mentioned, I do believe Chorus is gonna be that new must have effect for any John Mayer pedal board or any John Mayer fan. Now, if you want my advice and my prediction, I do believe the Boss CE2 is gonna be the most likely option and the best bet for kind of getting ahead of the curve of the future and the high demand and hype that we all know is gonna be behind the gear behind this new album. Now, the reason why I say the Boss CE2 is that John did use it, of course, during the 2019 World Tour, and he actually brought it out again for the Grammy performance back in early of 2021. Now, if he was sticking with that for this performance that we know occurred after the album had been finalized and written, odds are that it's probably a chorus that he'd been using on the album or plans on using for his upcoming tour. Because if he started using a different chorus pedal, for example, why would he bring out something he'd used before? And we know that's probably modded too because it's of course black. It doesn't just look like a standard Boss CE2. Well, there you guys have it. That's my prediction for the new must-have pedal for John Mayer fans going forward into 2021. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe, ring that bell button, do all the things that YouTubers ask you to do after your videos. I really do appreciate all the support and love my channel has been getting with the new videos I've been releasing and everything like that. As well, please comment down below what you think about Last Train Home's tone, the use of chorus, if you think it's gonna be a major thing for the album and the tour going forward, or if you think it's gonna be something John's just kind of messing around with on a song or two. And as always guys, take care and we'll see you in the next one.